All right, thank you. A vigil is being held this morning for a nurse who was killed in a random attack at a metro bus stop. And CBS News' Tina Patel is live near Union Station with a look at how she is being remembered this morning, Tina. Good morning. Shuttles with employees from County USC just showed up a short time ago and a number of people came out to be part of this vigil this morning. They wanted to remember their coworker and their friend. Take a look at this video. Sandra Shells was waiting for a bus here near Union Station last week when she was attacked by a homeless man. She fell to the ground, hit her head and died a few days later at the hospital. The 70 year old nurse had worked at County USC for nearly 40 years, so she was well known and well liked and her co-workers are having trouble understanding how they could have lost her in this way. Although they are grateful that the person responsible for her death has been arrested, this morning they are focusing on how she lived. The one thing the staff really wants is for people not to forget Sandy. Like I said, she's a professional, dedicated, outstanding, compassionate nurse. And um, she said they, uh, people were talking this morning on the shuttle on the way over, saying she was always in the locker room in the morning, welcoming people, always with a smile, always positive, and she will greatly be missed. Now, the hospital staff says a lot of people rearranged their schedules so those who knew and loved Sandy the most could be here this morning. There is going to be another vigil here later on this evening for those who work other shifts. We'll send it back to you in the studio.